Hey, good morning, guys. Now, law enforcement, they're still asking people to shelter in place as their manhunt continues for this shooter. The suspect is described as a firearms instructor. We're hearing from people who were inside that bowling alley when that shooting rampage began. I don't know how to explain it. I don't think you're supposed to see that in real life. Police believe that this man here, 40-year-old Robert Card, is behind the shooting. The Association Pre Associated Press described him as a firearms instructor who believed that he was in the Army Reserve as well. Now, police are saying his attack started in the Lewiston, Maine, which is about 45 minutes from Portland. And according to law enforcement, Robert Card was committed to a mental health facility for two weeks during the summer. He had told people he was hearing voices and he had threats to shoot up his military base. Now, police are saying the shooting spree started around 7 p.m. with Robert Card focusing his attacks on the Ski McGee's Bar and Grill and the Spare Time Recreation Bowling Alley. Now, these locations are just four miles from each other. Law enforcement is saying that at least 22 people have been killed with dozens more injured. We heard from a man who said he was inside that bowling alley for 10 minutes before the shooting started. He had to take cover by running down the bowling alley lane. Well, we were inside and just normal night of bowling and out of nowhere, he just came in and there was a loud pop. I thought it was a balloon. I had my back turned to the door. Um, and as soon as I turned and saw that it was not a balloon, he was holding a weapon, I just booked it um, down the lane and I slid basically into where the pins are and climbed up in the machine and was on top of the machines for about 10 minutes until the cops got there. Yeah, law enforcement said that they did find the suspect's vehicle in Lisbon, which is about eight miles away from Lewiston. Local schools said that they will close today and shelter in place has been expanded to multiple towns as more than 100 investigators continue their search for this gunman. Back to you guys in the studio.